definitely the wickedest thing I've ever in my life. Hello, this is Guten Schneider, and this is the second part of my helmet videos where I'm showing you how I built make well before I paint it. And this right now is in a newspaper state. And whenever you do any crafts, you must newspaper it. Otherwise, uh, paint will not stick. Especially because it's duct tape, since it's really a plastic, has like a plastic coating. My paint doesn't stick to it because I don't use spray paint. I use just regular brush-on paint from the dollar store. <laughs> and it's quite necessary because you can also hide imperfections because right now you don't see all this ugly cardboard and glue instead you see a very nice uniform dome shape and I'm thinking of making it black yeah maybe putting a couple nice pictures of oh, paintings yeah. and also I want to show you a sneak peek of a Mac 10 which I'm planning to have magazine release for it hold one second magazine just fell magazine goes in here and these are the two plates I'm hoping to make it feel strippable and that's it for my helmet. There's Mr. Box. Hello, this is Guten Schneider, and I'm just going to show you a portion of when I paint the helmet. And all you need for this is a bucket full of water, and a tray to hold your paint, paint, newspaper on the bottom, and paintbrush. And also a hairdryer. I plugged it in already. Now, this procedure goes for any of my cardboard creation creations. Shake the bottle. If I could open it, yeah. And you just pour some out. Actually, I found that if you're doing something like this, wet your paintbrush just a little. And pour the paint directly onto the object. And just paint. Get closer. And especially for black, when I use black, I really only need one or two layers. Normally I use two, at least two layers. Otherwise, and just paint enough layers until you can't see it. And, uh, see, it's already looking like a final product. And the reason I have the hair dryer Especially when you want to do camouflage and you only have a couple minutes or maybe an hour, is you take it and blow. Now, for this paint, already, oh, well, it's almost dry, but it really speeds up the process. And I'll show you when I'm done. 